Hi, I'm Stacy, your host of Two Chicks and a Goat. If you're new to our channel, please subscribe and hit the link below. Today, I just want to talk to you about the Cena Bluetooth headsets that we're going to try out. So I've got the two different brands, uh, well, same brand, two different types. You got the one that goes under your helmet and around the back of your head. And then I also have the unit that fits in to the side of your helmet. Uh, this one I purchased brand new on Amazon. And this one here actually got on uh, Facebook from a lady up in Windsor. Uh, brand new in a box, actually 50 bucks. Can't go wrong. Um, these other units, I think we're about at, um, two hundred dollars for two hundred and eight dollars for a double set I'll put a link below uh, into that but uh, this one I've already opened and sort of been playing around with it haven't really uh, done much to it but what I'm gonna end up doing is getting these mounted onto the helmets and once we get our bikes back because I've got them out just getting a spring service uh, we should have them back on Monday so I'm hoping Monday night if it's not pouring rain go for a ride with Christiana and try the two different sets out Ta -da! but right now what I'll do is unbox them and show you what's in them and see what we can do and also what the difference are so I might get my uh, big bulky helmet out of the way so this unit here it goes on to your helmet um, through just straps onto your regular mounts. Um, I've got one out, I've already played with it a bit, but it is very difficult to get into this spot. Uh, it's tight, it fits on pretty good. I'm just wondering if it's gonna be warm in the summer. But this one also has an FM radio, works on your cell phone and also for people communication that you can talk to as a group. So we haven't even tried it yet. So I'm still gonna see how that works. So that unit, the difference has an FM radio in it. Uh, this unit here can talk to four people as well. Uh, hooks to your cell phone so you can listen to music, answer uh, calls and things like that. Uh, you can jump in between four different riders, a group chat. It has two different uh, boom mics for it. Uh, online, a lot of people are saying that people can't even tell that they're on the motorcycle when they're riding with these things. So I'm very curious to try these out. And so here we go. So what I'm going to do is, uh, we're all, since I already have the other one open, we'll open this one here, and I'll show you what all the product comes with it. Okay. So you can see I already opened it. I cheated. So it has your book an install pad, an extra you know, dead cat, do you want to call it? And you have your two sides. So these just go over. Once I get it mounted, I'll show you. But they go over top of your straps. Slide up into your helmet. You have your speakers in here. That your cable goes behind the back of your helmet and then your boom mic. I had it on yesterday hooked to my phone just doing uh, some music. They actually sound pretty good. What I'll do is I'll get this one installed in my helmet. Actually I'm going to get this one installed in Christiana's helmet so you can see what it looks like. So give me two minutes we'll get this put in and then we'll do a full test hopefully on Monday.
buying one of these this summer. So this is going to look very strange because the helmet is... Oh, this guy died. But well, but the helmet is... Uh, it's very angry. The helmet is small on me. But this is what it would look like. The mic and talk. It's way more comfortable actually than it was in my helmet. This isn't that bad. It's pretty good. I like it. <laughs> helmet is really tight on me. But uh, you can see it's easy to access when you're riding the bike. Be able to turn your volume up and down if you need to or tap to change from radio or phone if you need to. Once you get it set up you can just cruise around, la la la, listen to your tunes, boogie on out, and then go, hey dude, uh, did you see that? <laughs> Uh, Christy and I use a lot of hand signals right now. Going this way, turning, up, down, slow, whatever, all kinds of things. So once we get these on, we'll be able to really talk uh, a lot better uh, to each other and communicate. So I think it'll be awesome. It'll be really good. And it doesn't look that constricting. Still nice. Like I said, worried with the pad on here that if it's going to be warm for in the winter or in the summer, I should say. So we'll put hers up there. Now as you can see, watch, see, look at the difference. Penis head. Not the look I'm going for. So I'm looking for a new helmet. Want to get uh, one of those, a new helmet, and we'll go. Ah. So what we'll do is I'll unbox the other unit, let you take a look at that. And then once I have them all out and sort of set up and linked, and we have our bikes back. I'll sort of test them out and let you guys know how they are. I broke a nail. Such a harsh job. Okay. So now we'll unbox this guy. So this is just the headset version. Everything's in. It doesn't come apart. Uh, I've heard some rumors about these pieces here being a little bit uh, light. And you have to really watch about breaking them. So these are about 200 I think 225 online and I, I managed to pick this up on Facebook uh, uh, brand new never used for 50 bucks today just happened to find it so this one I haven't truly opened everything yet So you can see it's everything is still in the box. You have a boom mic, your mini mic. I'll have to see what the difference for sound and on the motorcycle. Charging cable. The other one came with that as well. Uh, way more covers. That one has one extra set, and we've got multiple. No extra pads for that one, but this one comes with multiple. So it's got the two pads in there and two different ear covers. So I'm gonna have to read and find out what the difference these make for this unit to see what they uh, what it does. And then also it's got uh, another jack because you can actually wire this back and go in direct to your motorcycle. Or to, a lot of times this is for like climbing gear. I think this was originally done for. But uh, yeah, so it's, it's a nice little unit. Um, got your left and right, same thing. Got your volume, push the two buttons, power's on. It will blink to tell you what your power level's at. So it's at 75%. And if you hold it down, it'll actually tell you. So you can then. Install your mic. Air. 
arrow to arrow. <laughs> Get your proper little dead cat. Like I said, my biggest test is to see how these are going to work on the motorcycle. Um, snug. To see how they're going to work on the motorcycle. So... They clip on around your ears like a lot of sunglasses do. So we'll see. I'm going to take these guys off. I'm up here. Hmm. So they stay on pretty good. Uh, I'll have to see, sync it to my phone, test the speakers in it, uh, and see how it goes. I don't know if you can extend the back. I'd like to try to extend it just a little bit, but I don't know if it does or not. So I'll let you know and see. So this just seems a tiny bit short, but you know, I got a big head. Also, my worry with this unit is because this guy's got the thicker straps on it I want to get like Christiana's has just the thin straps and I think this is going to be an issue going around these guys So as you can see, it's a tight fit. I can uh, turn my volume. And the main thing is you have to be able to hit it to do functions. So the mic is here. It's not as far out as this one. But it's not bothering my ears. It's not touching the back of my helmet. Not sure you'll be able to see, but there's still about that much gap between the bar and my. And it definitely doesn't move around, so I have a feeling when I get a helmet like Christiana's with the thinner straps, it won't be an issue that the unit will be able to go through here. Don't scratch that, I get in trouble. But yeah, it's it's all pretty good. Definitely be able to hook up with this thing and going. So it actually, uh, comfort wise, both of them actually feel really good. So what we need to do now is actually test them for quality and see how they sound on the bike. Now my main, my end goal for this is that I'm also going to be buying the Cena GoPro adapter. So what it does is that when I am playing with one of these cameras on the motorcycle, you put a Cena adapter on the back. Uh, and what that does, it will pick up all of our conversation. So if I'm talking to you guys, uh, it will record on the, the Bluetooth. And also if I'm talking to Goose or Christiana, it will record on the camera as well. So that's what I'm looking for now. Ooh, the big test. Gotta have shades on when you're riding. That's not bad, actually. I was expecting it to be a little bit worse. Now, the good thing with this unit, which we can't use with those units, I can actually wear this on the kayak. So I might end up buying a second unit like this if uh, it works out. So that when we go kayaking and mountain biking and stuff, we can actually wear these and communicate with each other. 
Now these units, I have seen actually people, so these units, I've actually seen people, because it's the same strapping, put it on their pedal bike helmets, which we have, so we potentially might try that out and see if we end up going on a very long bike ride, but we're usually really close to each other when we're biking. It's, uh, I prefer, I prefer to, don't move. I prefer to try this, this one out in the kayaks, so as we take a little ventures and go off, but we'll be able to contact each other. They are water resistant, so if I'm in the rain and stuff like that, but if I figure if we drop it down in the water or go for a swim with it, it probably ain't going to work. But, um, so hopefully I'll be able to jump to the next part of the video when my bikes are back, doing a test with Christiane and I driving, and I'll let you know how they go. We do have two sets of these, so I'm going to try them as well, talking to each other, and then I'll try this unit here. Um, so the difference with this one, you can get FM radio. But usually if I'm on my bike, I'll have my Bluetooth uh, Spotify going and stuff. Like I said, the main reason we purchase these is so we can communicate with each other on our longer rides. Um, we're not constantly blabbing, but it's like, oh, did you see that moose back there? And, and Christian, I'm like, what moose? I didn't see it. So we can start a talk track that way. Or also it's like, okay, yeah, Goose is on the back and needs to, you know, pee break. <laughs> So it's easier to understand everybody. Also, if something's going wrong with the bikes, um, you can let the other person in front or behind know that there's something going on. Uh, and you can communicate with four people. There's usually only the three of us riding, so these will work fine, I think. So I'll let you know how they work on the bike. Testing one, two, testing. I can hear myself. So I'm not just talking to myself. Wow, that's pretty loud. Echoing in my ears. Hello? Hey, let's make a left on Albuquerque. Sweet. Haha, <laughs> I can't wait to try these. Test, 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 testing. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Sweet. Test, 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 listen. Testing, one, two, three. Testing. Hi, audience. Can you hear me? Okay, your turn to talk back. Hey, it's a family show, no swearing. I should put it on Ozzy. See if she can, we can have a conversation while walking around. You can hear the echo from this thing. It's that loud. That's awesome. I get end call. Oh, oh, where is it? Call. Call ended. Sweet. Can't wait to try these on the bike.
Okay. I tried this guy out. So it's just a headset one. Uh, not talking to Christiana. She had, her bike wasn't ready. So I stole mine. But I made a phone call uh, to her. She said she can hear a little bit of wind. I can hear her perfect. It does sound like walkie talkie kind of conversation. <clears throat> but as long as my music was perfectly clear, it was weird. I've never driven my bike with uh, music before. So it was pretty strange. And uh, <laughs> you gotta keep around your surroundings a little bit. I usually like listening to the sounds. But it didn't muffle up my pipes because I love listening to my pipes. So. Cool. Uh, I'll give this guy a thumbs up. Maybe we'll, uh, we get more reviews. Uh, Christian and I will uh, test out the other ones and see. But I'll end this video with this guy going thumbs up. I like it. It's pretty good. Try him out. Uh, we're going to try it on the kayak later on and see. But uh, see you on the road. Thanks for watching.